Hi everyone, it is Friday, January 26th. Let's go ahead and wrap up the month of January. I'm excited to talk about what we have going on during the 28 day month of February because the energies have introduced a challenge. But our challenge is going to be quite different. It's a challenge slash breakthrough. So we'll be most definitely talking about kinetic energy and chemical energy and fusion. That's challenge breakthrough energy so the energies will feel as if they're going reverse parallel to line themselves up to create some type of fusion regarding time and timelines now some of you tribe you will go into this energy quite easily because this is the key what do we have that other challenges don't have? Well, well, because it's not really a challenge, it's a challenge breakthrough. Well, we have Saturn, we have the Taskmaster like that. We have energies that are working, that are conducive for this to happen. Now, because remember Saturn's present being future, Saturn's future being present, and all that entails as it relates to creating and manifesting what you call the here and now. So very exciting energies. Now, along with this, is it will be it's going to start the first of February, run its way through January, January through February twenty eighth. Some of you, this is what it is because we're speaking of timelines with Saturn ruling time, and Saturn's time is always about the past, being the gatekeeper to the future. Now, some of you, you've already had the outcome of what we're speaking of specifically of this challenge breakthrough you've already had the outcome so this is what's going to happen for you starting february 1st february 28th the energies will still be functioning reverse parallel in order for fusion to happen that's chemical and kinetic energy and fusion it will feel because it is lining itself up so what will happen with you all's breakthroughs that you already had is that that breakthrough will be infused with energy because the energy will be working reverse parallel in order to align itself the, the rate of speed it depends because it depends on the quantum fields that you all are functioning within as an individual and that could be a multitude of them because saturn remember as it creates the future being present it pulls from a multitude of past lifetimes that is denoting a multitude of different energetic vibrations energetic bodies it's to you which are connected to you regarding quantum fields and timelines so the rate of speed will be different but it will take a only a 28 day time period i told you all last week that saturn was going to be infusing itself quite um not intensely but a little bit more like push energy like like pushing because of what needs to happen what needs to be applied what needs to be put into practice to get things lined up and ready for when we had the eclipse in the sign of libra eclipse in the sign of aries which is what i feel that it is um i feel that is what march 24th around the end of march or something like that so those energies have to be lined up for that to happen so it would be about it, it, it would be a, so the rate of speed for, for everybody tribe it would be that 28 day period and the rate of speed is determined by the um because remember with, with saturn's energy how how the state is not pulling from one past lifetime at a time is pulling from um, cause we talk about correction age. We talk about the energy, the workers with three dead 90 meets and everything that is within between that three dead 90 energy. So the energies they pull not from one lifetime at a time is like pulling from multiple of them because of the energetic connection and what it is and what it denotes. So it would be that, that rate of speed is going to be different for all of you based on the, the quantum field lifetime that the energy was pulled from. So, but it will all take a 28 day period. So you know, put, wrap your mind around that. Now, so when we talk about, so those of you that have already had the result is, is going to be quite positive to see how things round out for you because of what Saturn needs to layer on top of your result to seal it after whatever is going to be taken away in that eclipse with, um, Libra and Aries. So it is, there's a lot that's going to be, that's going to be coming after that energy is sealed 
foundation. Remember, we're talking with Saturday's past life foundations or this lifetime foundations that are already set, um, strong, durable, that have been patched work for some of you like that. And then others of you, it could have been whatever you were um, looking at regarding the foundation, whatever you were applying regarding the foundation, because of how do you want the foundation to evolve itself. Now, so that's going to be very interesting. So let's talk about what this this challenge breakthrough energy is about. It's things that you've already been doing. Remember, because Saturn's energy is always about always always about the past. Try now. So it's things that you've already been been doing and putting into its place like that. But you, you've been having that back resource coming in. Because remember I stated about having an unending reservoir of resources. Intellectual resource, practical resource, everything that is a resource, everything that belongs to you coming in in a quantitative mode regarding present, Saturn's future being present, Saturn's future being present, Saturn's present being future, Saturn's future being present, regarding what is necessary and needed. You already know how Saturn works like that with time. Now, Saturn's energy, obviously, we've been connected with every quantum time like that because it's 3d time and you're having your experience in the third dimension state of where experience can happen okay now so it is sound of energy how it it moves so because it has to go over every minutia which is a very important resource for you like that with that within what you carry energetically like that it tweets it it highlights it like that it it ch ch your energy chills it the energies come in okay that align with that chiseling like that that's where the energy the the whatever type of energy we're speaking of be regarded whatever it is what space um state of consciousness is coming in what space and time is coming in like that what the actual experience is about and the energy that is determined the determined that goes with that experience now so with with the with the challenge aspect of it, it well the, the hell that it, it all of it is a all of it rounding out and being cohesive was the challenge. Now, <laughs> you know, so you're past that regarding this specifically. It's about the applying. That's why it's challenge breakthrough. It's about the being able to apply now without the pushback. And now the push back, go, push back, go, because because of how the energies have to work in unison like that. Coming from different energetic vibrational fields, quantum fields with different timelines, different spaces in time like that. Now, past lives, all of that, how it has to travel here within your energy and functions within your energy and within whatever experience you are that is being manifested created like that from past Saturn only recycles you know is like that so it would be where where those components rounding themselves out the push go energy is the resources coming in you correctly applying but the energy needing a fusion of energy our energy, when you're talking about quantum fields and quantum lines, where there are multiple time lines, all of them very significant. Okay. Now, how, how they come in as it relates to them working together is not coming from one timeline and coming to the third of state of consciousness and connect to you. Come from multiple, Saturn pool from multiple past lives, multiple quantum energy, like that. Okay. So, is they all have to be functioning in unison. That's why you have that application testing it functions pull back because it's not time yet all the timelines have to be ready to work in fusion in unison so your challenge breakthrough will be starting february 1st through february 28th you'll be able to apply those resources without much apply 
back apply back because you'll be out of the testing of the energy the energy will actually be fusing it fusioning fusioning itself into your vibration into your state of consciousness the the um future which is present present which is future will be actually being created with the, all the energies lining up regarding whatever i'm talking about specifically and whatever i'm talking about specifically is going to be different for all of you so that's what february will most definitely um entail and all the resources that you need that are necessary for this have come in that you'll be applying to this specifically you've already you've always had ownership of them but when, when saturn is creating the future which is present present which is future the resources have to be tweaked the energies have to come in and infuse them and, and they have to be set upon specific timelines their vibration and how they function within their own timeline within their own um, space and time within their own quantum existence and how they function and connecting with your energy connecting with your future being present present being future all of that is taken into account like that so now those of you that are part of my accountability coaching class tomorrow on saturday when we meet uh, you you all will have a because of what you all are um working on specifically you all will have a different um challenge breakthrough like that that is gonna because be you'll be working with me the rest of us tribe we have saturn we had like the taskmaster and we've already done the work it's about the career way out of the karmic energy we already done, done the work okay it's about the what is coming in to be rounded out this is about specifics like that because saturn works in because mm, mm, what is being transmuted what is being created with saturn being the organic recycling the past like that so it would be about um about that energy and 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 how it's fusing it itself into this this future being present present being future and preparing itself for what the eclipse is going to take away completely Saturn is going to layer atop that, sealing something in, and then the, the continuum of the building onto that will, will be there like that. So it's very going to be very, it's going to be something here to, to see. But remember, as I stated, you'll be applying the resources, your own resources, you'll be applying, okay, like that. You, you'll be doing that still. Okay. And you all will have a lot of awareness, you know, Saturday sober, okay, you know, and, and about the components of the functionings of things. Okay, everyone, until next time, thanks for watching. Bye.